Hello, I'm AJ Puzzle Throws, and welcome back to Titan Quest, where we just I saved this little village from. But since the monsters, it's been swords and shields, greaves and spears. Yes, where we just saved this little village from having all of its water poisoned by a bunch of horrible spiders. Okay, now we don't need dexterity, so hmm, I think this armor can go. Uh, let's see. Our current weapon is better. Our current weapon is better still. Uh, yep, our current weapon is better. And that is needing strength. Oh, strength. Hmm. All right, I'll put a little bit more in strength. Oh, now I can use it. Brilliant. All right, and it gives me some life regen as well, which is excellent. Okay, let's get rid of that. And that too. And also this. Yes. Okay. I'm keeping this because I don't know. I, I feel like it's going to be handy at some stage. So we're having it. Oh, wait a minute. Have I got enough? Ah, I got 50 health potions. I should be okay. I don't really need to talk to everybody in town. So I'm leaving them. What's down here? I don't remember going this way. Let's... Get our main skill active. Oh, it's undead. Yes, forget them. Hmm. <laughs> We're going the other way, because the other way isn't full of undead. Oh, wait. He says, watching the crowd of zombies walk in. Stagger in, slowly. Level 9? Crikey. Yes, kill them. That's it. But make sure I get plenty of experience from them on the way. Good, good. Ah, is that an experience shrine I see over there? No, it is a shrine of frost. They're really good because they add extra cold damage to everything, which means that you can hit things and watch them all die horribly. Very quickly indeed. Yes, I always like those. Early on, they're helpful. Later on, not so much because obviously I don't think that they do as much damage later on but it's as good as having a um, experience increasing shrine as long as you've got loads of monsters around for if you keep hitting things and moving on to the next thing that dies that dies and you get more experience because you're just killing more so yes excellent stop shooting me they're really not doing too much damage at the moment oh of course I've got the regen haven't I Oh, that is going to be useful. I need more regen items. For all of the regen possible would be handy. Hi, ball. There's another one. Usually I'm carrying a staff at this point, so I'm not used to having much by way of regen. Hmm. I might have to consider regen as the, 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 the main thing that I'm aiming for. I don't know. We'll have to see. As time goes on, I'm sure I will decide. Oh, hello. This is the other end of that uh, that place. Don't you shoot me. Here, have some have some of that to deal with. <laughs> ah. Okay, I'll get rid of all of the people who have bows first. You can go. Because I don't like being shot. And then we can go for the poison beasties. Of which there are many. <laughs> it's nice to be facing the undead for a change, though. Instead of just running away from them like I usually do. We're already down to 49 health potions. I've had all of one! Oh, dear. Hmm. Do I want to go in here? Or is this just going to summon loads more undead? Ooh, hello. Heart piece. That looked like a better item to me. And we haven't had too many of the better items yet. Hello there, archers. No, I say. You all get to die. Excellent. Hmm. I'm quite fond of birds in general. Birds are nice, but uh, the, the poison ones? No. <laughs> right. Let's see what that item was. Where's it gone? Ooh, it's a sword. Hmm, but I need more dexterity for it. It isn't as good with damage. It's got 30% piercing ratio. I have no idea. 
Uh, reduce to enemy's health. That's good. Extra piercing. Hmm. Hmm. It's not bad. It's not like something that's super amazing and I can't actually use it yet, but uh, it's, it's not bad. We're so close to leveling. I just need a tiny bit more. Nice little boat. I, I don't think I've been in a little rowboat yet. Oh, I might have been in a rowboat. I think at a, at a, uh, at a, at a park somewhere I've been in a rowboat. Hmm. This looks dangerous, doesn't it? Yes, let's come back to this later. Ha! It's probably a quest. It's most likely a quest. But never mind. We were on our way. Somewhere else. Somewhere that isn't in there. Best way. I'll get over there. All right. Back through the Sater camp. Hello, birds. Why are they frozen? Since when did it start freezing things? Oh, wait. That's the wrong skill. Why is that in there? <laughs> that shouldn't be in there. Squall should be in there. Weird. Oh, well, at least I know that that actually freezes more than one thing now. I thought that it only froze one thing. Freezing blast. Encases enemies in ice. It's actually quite good. I'm quite surprised with that. I thought it was rubbish. Hmm, okay. Anyway, we have skills to spend, so let's get spending skills. Ah, we are at that point. The point where we can actually access our next mastery, and I think I will do that. I know I should be spending points in other things, but I, I, I want to get to this, because this reduces the strength requirement of all weapons. And at the moment, that's actually quite handy. Uh, it'll mean that I will know what to, to do with the uh, the stuff. And this tells us that we get strength and intelligence from this. Okay, so we're getting strength and... Hang on. And dexterity? We get quite a lot in everything. That's cool. Whereas this one mostly gives us intelligence and dexterity. Okay, so we're getting dexterity from both. And intelligence from both. This one's giving us a tiny bit of strength, but not much. So really, strength is the thing that we need to put points into. Now that was passive, so uh, hopefully all weapons will just have their their values listed a little bit less now. For that, anyway. Can we see? Ah, I have no idea. <laughs> anyway, I'm going to leave those two points because we can we can decide what to do with them later. Until I find something that really requires them, they can stay as they are. Now, I could totally be, be raiding this entire place. But should I? Or should I just carry on? What's over here? There is a path. Ooh, hello! Shrine of Mastery. Hello there. I do like a good Shrine of Mastery. Okay, let's do the... Squall thing. Ooh, look at that. So in about four skill points, that squall thing's going to look really cool. But we're only taking the squall to level six because I want points free for other things. I can fill it up later with a, with more, but currently, best not. That wasn't me. That was them. <laughs> so they cast it themselves. I don't know how many things cast the squall. I think there's this, this sort of gin type thing later on that uh, that also casts it. But at the moment, I only know of the birds that do. Ah, there's bird nests everywhere. As if those things are going to nest in that. I mean, that's like way up high. Right. Let's go over here. Where our next... Our next... Um... Fountain of uh, Renewal, or whatever it is, is around. Come on, then. I kind of want to know what the spell break is going to do, because uh, as far as I know, that actually really damages spell users. So hopefully it should do a good job. Now, I could clear this area that we're in, or I could move on. I think I'll move on. I'm sure that at some stage I'm going to get to a point where I find it's too difficult to move on any further, but uh, it's easier to just get get through. So I shall just go through. Hello there. D 
dark satyr. What's the difference between a dark satyr and a not so dark satyr? An ash straight bow, perhaps. Hmm. Not enough dexterity. Boo. Well, we're definitely going to de get dexterity from uh, from the uh, sh um. Oh, masteries. That's the one. <laughs> I knew it. there was a word I was looking for. Here you. Ah, why do you always move? Don't move, get blasted. That's the idea. I'm running out of health potions. Use the squall. That's it. Good, good. It doesn't do too much damage at the moment. It really doesn't. I should definitely be using it more, though. For it is handy. Can you destroy those? No. Nice crystal thing. It's nothing more ominous than big black crystals coming up from the ground. <laughs> well, I suppose there could be fire and brimstone everywhere, but who knows? That might be brimstone. I'm not sure. We're getting closer to the beach. The beach and the turtles of doom. I'm hoping that I'm not going to be... Uh, too close to the Turtles of Doom for a little while. Ah, rats! Turtles of Doom! Ooh, I do so hate the Turtles of Doom. They slow you down, I think. Ah. They're a pain. But, with the Squall, I should do better. I need to grab more um, mana potions. We're doing quite well with the XP as well. Hello there, Merman, or whatever you are. Stuff to stuff to rob. A Mimidon. Hmm. A strange beastie. That's what I'm counting it as. I can't have him regenerating people's life. Go away, shaman. P.S. Nice staff. Hmm. I don't think he cares though. <laughs> I love the water effects. They're done quite well with those. It really does look like a nice, a nice beach with uh, rock pools and that sort of stuff, which is brilliant. Okay, more turtles of doom. They can accept the squall of pain. Good. <laughs> they don't give me anything. This is definitely one of the areas that I would usually sort of just run past because I don't like killing these things. Turtles in real life are so much nicer, I think. Having never met one, I wouldn't know, but, you know. I would have thought that they would have been so much nicer than this. They don't spit at you, for starters. Hi. Coastal Ichtherian. It's a strange name. They look like the sort of group of monsters that would have a, a proper society, though, don't they? Hello there. Enjoy the squall. Ah. And you. Now they're nasty, they are. Dual wielding? Dual wielding meanness. That's what they are. Okay, more skeletons down. Good, good. Still using up life potions like mad. Hello. Ah, people are shooting me. That's no good. Oh dear, oh dear. Go away. Stop it. He missed! <laughs> as long as he's all the way over there, he might find that that helps him miss quite a lot. And it'll kill him if I keep doing it. Yeah, they're really bad at aiming when you uh, when you use the squall on them. He Nearly. Ah, he got me. Go away. Good show. Padded wraps of life. Ooh, does that mean life? I mean, I could do with life. That is true. Especially considering how dangerous everything is. Go away. You can go away and all. There we go. Right, what's this? Regeneration! Brilliant. Ooh, they're all dead. I love these boats. These are uh, these these could quite end quite possibly end up in the uh, in the uh, thumbnail. 
Definitely, because boats! Nah. Hi. Oh, you don't get to kill the seagull. I thought it was going to charge at me then. Fight me with its poop, maybe. <laughs> Bye, skeletons. Excellent. If I remember rightly, we're going to a, a small village close by. And we might actually get our first backpack. Because you collect, like, five or so backpacks to actually increase your inventory size. And it does considerably increase your inventory size, so we're, we're definitely looking forward to this. Hmm. Straight bow of destruction? Yes. You can go. I should use that second skill more often. The freeze people skill. Though it only lasts for a few seconds. Alright. What's around here? I don't need to go into that because it's... The cave doesn't have anything important in it. As far as I know. So we'll just continue along the beach. Wow. There are a lot of things shooting at me. No, 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 no. This is one of those areas that I usually just run across. And don't bother with. Because you can just run past all of these. And those things are horrible. Go away. We're doing well. We're doing really well. To be able to walk up... Ah, ha, ha, ha. One of my first uh, energy potions. Good, good. We're nearly there. I'm certain of it. Unless this is the wrong place. In which case, we might not be nearly there. But I think we're nearly there. Moon pile. Whose bones are those? Butler of Recovery. That's, I should probably pick up that. You never know when a, a, a shield is going to be handy. Until you check it, and then you know. Right. Beast Man. I don't think we get any skills that are actually particularly good against beast men. I think there's certain classes that have skills that are, are specifically good against beast people. Like the, uh, the, um, ah, uh, what is it? It's like a hunting class and, uh, it's, it's really good against beast people. You have no more And everything else, really. <laughs> Bye. You don't all need to die. That's, that's the thing. You don't all need to die. Oh. They're all going to attack them. I might get the kills. Maybe. I did. Awesome. Ah, it was me. I saved you. Ish. Sort of. Okay, so now we are in Megara. Awesome. Hello there. We've got troubles. Every part of Greece is troubled these days. Mm. Sure, the centaurs and the satyrs are bad. But for us, the walking dead are worse. Yeah, Every I don't like night they're at the city walls. We wake to more farmland burned and cattle slain. Ah, farmland burned, of course. I remember this. There's some uh, farmland up there which we need to go to. Hello there. The truth is, I've just arrived here myself. Ah. I was on a warship bound for Athens when Siren Song drove the crew mad. Lovely. Unguided, our ship smashed against some rocks. I clung to a board and somehow washed ashore along with plenty of other timber and much of our cargo, which was arms and gold. Ah. Did you pick up all of the arms and the gold? That is a very important question. Hi. Muse, grant me voice. Voice and memory to tell about the first of wars. The old is it a long story? In the times before the gods had come to rule. When they were bowed beneath the heavy titan hand. Mm. The ill-formed titans, great in strength and cruelty, oppressed the gods, their offspring. Until at last, behind ah. the leadership of lightning-wielding Zeus, the gods took arms against the titan kings. It was the first war, and the greatest. Mm. Oceans were moved, and mountains overturned. Gods and titans struggled for dominion. Might and cunning making victors first of one and then another. Until at last, wearied in their age, the titans lost the war. So it is a long the story. Gods threw down their foes beneath the earth into the pit of Tartarus. Yeah. Except for one. 
the strongest and cruelest of the Titans. And he, they chained beneath a mountain for revenge. Ah. Then Zeus was king of gods and ruler over all the world. Cool. Thanks for the story, mate. Okay. What's this? Enchanter. Ah, so that's where I make those uh, items that I was talking about in a previous episode. All of these things... You add them together to make specific formula, which you have to find around the place. So I haven't got any at the moment, which means I can't do anything with said enchanter at this point. But, where are, what, what else is there? There's this chap over here. Sword and shield, not your style? Oh. I think you'll find what you're looking for here. He's not who I expected. No, he's just a trader of magical stuff. So, yeah, he's, not, he's nothing to worry about. I might get rid of this, though. Hang on, as is worse. Okay, I'll get rid of as because it's worse. Uh, this gives us extra health. That already gives us extra health, so that's not really useful. And this gives us extra health as well as what we got, so let's put that on. Good, good. And that can go. This is our old rubbishy weapon, so that can go. Ooh, that is not as good as as, is it? No. So that can go as well. As can that. Brilliant. Right. We are off then, but we could do with some more health potions. Because you know how quickly I go through those. Okay, uh, what are these? These look like formula for... Th well, one of them was a formula for stuff, wasn't it? No, it wasn't. But you need these for formulas as well. I know this. And I don't think I need to buy any of those. They... they Everything in the shops is usually way too expensive to be buying at this point in the game. Welcome, welcome. A fine warrior like yourself. I'm sure I've got just what you're looking this for. This is another throwing axe. Cool. I've still yet... I, I think that these have been added with, with the, uh, with the uh, expansions because I'm pretty sure there wasn't throwing weapons like this before. I'm almost certain of it. So, yes... But when you throw them, surely they'd have a stack size or something. I mean, do they do they just come back to you or something? How, how, do, how do they work? Hello there, sir. So, Leonidas sent you. Yes. He must have his hands full if he didn't come himself. Well, there's a, there are a lot of monsters. All over Greece, not mm. just in Sparta. Perhaps the Oracle can reveal the source behind all these attacks. I bet she can. The Oracle requires an offering when one requests an audience. Take a branch from the sacred olive tree to the Oracle of Delphi. The greatest of the oracles. Kings and tyrants from the world over seek her prophecies. You will find the sacred olive tree in a grove on the road to Delphi. Above awesome. the Helicos Pass. Okay. Take care, warrior. I shall. He says, walking off. Ooh, hello. Yay, we have our first backpack. Well, sort of pouch, as it were. It seems to be a pouch rather than a backpack, so she's got that little hole in the top and two pieces of string to hold it open okay fair enough well we've got we've got plenty of space in our inventory now that's excellent everyone's talking about the undead i bet they are the living bones that attack us many in magara whisper rumors but i know the truth i know where they come from i crept out one night just before dawn and followed quietly there is a ruined city built by the mycenaeans long ago that cool. we call old Eleusis. it was there they went there I followed them and watched them pour into the old stone gates. Awesome. Okay, hello. There's hello. In other words, there's someone else over here. That reminds me of an old myth they tell of the ruins. They say it was ruled by three brothers, eh, three princes. Ooh. But in their hubris, they offended the god Apollo. He cursed them never to enter Hades, but to walk all the Lucis as restless and dead. Now that one, those quests, I happen to know those quests are quite difficult. So those quests might be quite the challenge. Unfortunately, I'm all out of time, so I shall have to take on their challenge in the next episode. But in the meanwhile, you take care. Thanks for watching. Feel free to watch other things in, on my channel. Feel free to subscribe if you haven't already. Catch you next time. Bye for now.